I look so crazy right now. The room looks freaking crazy right now, but that's because I'm packing up to make the big move to Oregon tomorrow. So my flight leaves at 6.55 in the morning, and then I have a layover that's like two hours or something like that in Dallas. And then um, after that, I get to Portland, Oregon at around, I think like... I think like 12 30 or something like that so i'm super excited but i'm kind of stressing because i have to try and figure out how to fit all of my clothes in two suitcases and i'm just like oh my god i don't i don't know how this is gonna work so clothes shoes makeup hair products basically just everything that i can possibly fit in two suitcases i'm kind of tripping um stress a little bit and yeah so i'm just gonna vlog a little bit take you guys with me i don't usually vlog so i don't know how good this vlog is gonna be sorry in advance if it's not very fun or entertaining right now i'm like real low energy but hey we're gonna power through this we're gonna get through this i'm gonna pack we're gonna you know we got this i'm just rolling everything that way i can kind of maximize my storage space and i'm kind of tripping like i said because you guys look at this I only really have this suitcase to work with. These clothes right here still need to be packed. These clothes are like maybes. These clothes are like maybes. I still need to do this laundry right here, which is some whites. Um, those aren't going. These all need to be packed, everything on the bed. All of those shoes over here in this corner area. All of this like makeup right here needs to be packed up still, which is like stressing me out because how where because i also have these jackets right here that i still need to pack up and i'm just need this to say i'm just kind of stressed right now you guys oh my gosh oh and this stuff right here which is like bras panties intimate stuff like that this right here is everything that was packed up i went through all of these boxes and kind of picked through to determine what i really needed what i really didn't need and so oh, oh i forgot i also need to pack up these shoes so as you guys can tell this is probably not going to go very well my nails are over here looking like trash i need to do them but that's besides the point so oh and these are maybe shoes right here so i'm gonna have my mom ship me my lights at a later time resting the the knock out right now so i'm gonna stop talking like i said i'm gonna do a time lapse and i promise i'm gonna look cuter oh hey girl just back here chilling like hey hey Good, drop that thing, drop it low, drop it. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put you on a time lapse and get this thing popping or whatever. if you guys hear the heater my mom's heater is like really loud i don't know it's weird but um if you guys don't know the story i basically i haven't been home for like seven months eight months or something crazy like that i was in vegas and while i was in vegas my mom moved so she packed up my room for me Right after I went to Vegas, I left from Vegas and went to Portland, Oregon to see and visit my sister and my nephew. And while I was there, we just, I talked to my sister and we just decided, you know what? YOLO, turn up, life is short, I'm moving to Portland. So I'm thankful and blessed to have a place in Portland to stay while I kind of get on my feet and figure life out. And you know, you know, that's a whole nother story in video. But yeah, so I'm gonna go there and see where life takes me i'm excited i'm a west coast baby y'all know that so i'm excited to be back on the west coast i kept saying i really wanted to go back um 
I don't really I like Orlando but it's definitely not for me it's crazy because the west coast and the east coast are so different and so I just because I'm used to the west coast it's just I feel like Orlando is like just not home it doesn't feel like home on the east coast so I feel like I'm home when I'm on the west coast and I'm excited to get back home I'm just waiting for my lift. It's freaking freezing in Portland. Also, I thought I was gonna die on the airplane. The turbulence was so bad, they almost had to reroute us because it was that bad. So I'm a little bit traumatized right now. If you know me, you know that I freaking hate roller coasters, I hate flying, I hate all of that. So, but we made it alive, so I'm good. We made it, baby. Everything I bought for Christmas, I had to buy two. So I had these already, right? But then I had to do these. Then I had to get these. Oh, this is cute. Ooh, ooh, that. Ooh, mm -hmm. look at her brows, bro. Perfect. She that she. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, this color. That mm -hmm. would never look like I it would look on a white girl on me. Okay. Look, look, look at how pretty. <laughs> look, this bruh. color right here, bro. Every time I go into Florida, I, I look for this. Even though it's like a hundred and sixty dollar palette. It's Natasha Denona. Yes! Oh, and it's no. sold out every time and they had it. They look so I had no too. choice. Ooh. And this one was cheap. But like, no, no. Look. What what is it? Violet Boss? Oh yeah, Violet Boss is good. It's cheap. And it's nice. It's a nice color. You know what's crazy? These are all the same it's colors. They all the same. Hold on. They're all the Not same. That. They're all the same. <laughs> I like what I like. They're all the same colors. I like what I like. But you like warm, neutral yeah. colors. So then I had to get some, you know, beauty concealer. It just had to, huh? Then I got a new foundation. Then I got her foundation. And then I had to get this. Your makeup finna be on fleek. Real fine. Oh, oh, yeah. And then I got some. No, oh my <laughs> God. Then I got this cream blush. It's nice cream. I, I've been really liking cream blushes. You know what else I've been liking a lot lately? Like, ooh, that's a dark, deep one, too. You know what else I've been liking a lot lately? You. When you, like, put some blush on your nose. I like that. Nah. <laughs> We're at Walmart right now, and we got, look what they got at Walmart. They got the, the thick hair ponytails. Wait, but are these ones? These ones look dope. Are they good, though? Can they, can they withstand the heat? Can they no, withstand the heat? No, <laughs> you know I got a lot of hair. I can't have them folding under pressure. <laughs> Come no. on. No, that's First of all, this is string. That's OD. This is string like you put in a little ball. Look. Oh, no. Yeah, goody. Like yarn. Goody stripping. It's Whose just, hair? Whose? Who, Kayla, whose hair is this going to hold? I think this that one's nice, but I feel like... I mean, that's just like a big scrunchie. I want those. I'm gonna get I'll those. Take this one. I have these ones right here, <laughs> but I thought it said gimme. <laughs> it did say gimme. <laughs> it says gimme. What does it say? <laughs> you what? You what know you? how you spell gimme. Give give Come on, gimme your five pack. What I you think mean? it says gimme. What you think it says? It says gimme. That ain't how you spell gimme. <laughs> how you say gimme? No. Well, that's gim. <laughs> gimme. Gimme. Wait, you took the last one. <laughs> <laughs> Yeet. That's okay. I think it's a sign. Nah, I don't need them. Nah, nah, nah. That's a sign. They so good. Everybody took them. I think I need. I don't even need no scrunchies right now. How do you? How do you say it? Sarave. Sarave. 
or Cerevi? Cerevi. 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 You just want it to be suave. Maybe it's <laughs> okay, but I heard that Cerave has really it good. Extra. I, I want to try one of those black mask things, though. The ones that you peel off. That one? Yeah, I like them. Oh, that one's open. You saw it? It's open. I heard. I used to use Cetaphil, but that didn't really do nothing for me. Do you think. You think it needs to be like the daily, it needs to be a face moisturizer yeah. or it needs, can I just use a lotion? Face. I don't have to wear a lotion. But they have one for the day and the night. I, I just want, night. but what if I use it during the day? Night. Plus it's oil free. They ain't no, see, that's where they're trying to get you. The, the package says the same thing. So they do the same. Oh, one has sunscreen, one doesn't. I don't like when it has sunscreen because it makes my eyes water and I have sensitive eyes. So I'm going to get this one. Stop it. Chef B does it again. What we got here, Chef B? Got that good old lemon pepper and wings. You feel me? Ooh! With that good uh, garlic and lemon Brussels sprouts. Okay, he got me on that keto because of her. Because of her. Appreciate you. <laughs> AB, shout out to uh, Instagram for him one time. Oh, man, Chef B PDX, man. You already know where it's at, man. Mm -hmm. Chef B PDX. I'm going to put his information down in the description box below, but y'all got to check him out. Because he come with the heat. Oh, yeah. Lemon pepper. Yeah, you ready? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love you. I didn't even use any rest. Oh, boy, that got some flavor. Especially when you start to walk in, oh my god, no of us. I'm sorry. It's so sad when they're baby. You're so helpless and he just can't do anything, he just knows it hurts. I know, but can do anything, it's okay. That's how you get strong. That's how you get big and strong. Say hi to the people on the blog. Oh, say hi. You want to hold it? Look who's yeah. that? Hi. Who is that? Oh, you smell like a blueberry. Mm. See, I smell good. Mm. Those sticky, uh, mm. sticky mm. honey one joints, the sriracha. Go. Oh, mm. She wow. likes those. I gave her the recipe for those. And they're baked. And they're all baked. Keto. That's keto. And not breaded. And not breaded. They're just crispy from the oven. So yes, it's draining all the moisture. How do you do that? Water. Oh, how long do you that? Oh. I rinse them and then I um I leave them in the strainer for a little bit and then I pat them dry with paper towel till they're completely dry. Then I toss them in some oil, then throw them in the oven. Oh, <laughs> I thought that was you. Man. <laughs> she copying you. They come out crispy. You melt your butter with the two tablespoons in there. Mix I got them, something in my teeth. Each one of the wings with the stuff on top. You wasn't gonna tell me it had something between my teeth. Wait, we want to know too. We want to know what the winner is. Oh, okay. Uh, well, she got this the one he used, y'all. I use it this is one. so good. <laughs> so, so good. Y'all gotta say, one. like I said, go in the description box and follow him on Instagram because he be posting all his food on there. I don't know which one you have. So freaking good. <laughs> Bye. I'm gonna get one of those things that go right here, but not right there. Yeah, I got one in the stick, so I got mad. So I got mad. <laughs> oh, that's one thing. Kayla got road rage on Kumbo. She got road rage. I'm gonna catch it one day. Me? Oh, on the way, on the on the way to the game one day. I'm gonna catch me? it. Who me? See, my mama's right. Can you get off my ass, old lady. <laughs> Oh, that's one thing. Kayla got road rage on Kumbo. I'm gonna Me? You. I'm trying to park, damn! <laughs> I'm trying to park, damn! Damn, what the fuck? It's the second time she seen me trying to park my car and I ain't parallel right. 
<laughs> I wish y'all could see the tears. I have a tear falling down my cheek. I'm crying. I'm crying. She, what I tell you, she got the worst. It was an old couple. <laughs> Oh my god, she got the worst road rage ever, bro. It's hilarious. And she be silent. Oh my gosh. Okay, anyway, um, we just got to the margarita tasting place. So we're gonna taste the margaritas because Kayla's having uh uh mistletoes, mistletoe and margaritas Christmas pajama jam. Look at the tears <laughs> on the uh 22nd. So we're gonna taste some margaritas. Yo, living in Portland's Portland. <laughs> living in Portland's gonna be a problem. <laughs> the <pocket. laughs> Yes, That's I can't. Town. I can't. I can't parallel park. Mm -hmm. I had to go to my lawyer's office the other day and I had a parallel park and I was stressed. <laughs> Cars was behind me. You're I couldn't move fast enough. Are you You're ready or are we waiting for us? Uh... Ready, my waiting. I'm just leaving my bed. Oh, the the other nanny. <laughs> she be she be creeping on her nannies. <laughs> what <and> the f <laughs> <laughs> Stop Stop it. It. Was she was she hella close? Oh <laughs> it's hella weirdos in Portland. Mm. Open. Huh? Open seating. The tamarind margarita. No. Next up is going to be our mango. No. One of my favorites is definitely the strawberry super solid passion fruit. Ooh, passion fruit sounds good. And my definite neighbor is the black hair. It's really good. But, uh, what are you trying, Matt? Thank you so much. One more straw? Yeah. Yeah, uh, one more straw, like. It's like, three. like, yeah. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to set the camera up, but I can't figure out anywhere to put it. To get all three of it. Hey, girl. This is Brandy. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's good. Which one is that one? Thank you. I smell cinnamon. Is it cinnamon? I smell it. I didn't expect that. It's so a sour cream, so it does tame it down a little bit. Okay. Um, I've actually had it before mixed with a sour cream, and it's like a black salsa of death. Oh. And it makes you like sweat. Anything with death in it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. She's a, yeah. yeah <laughs> Um, I'll also put you a spicy margarita too. Okay. Ooh, try that thank one. you. Spicy sauce. Awesome. Cool, yes. thank you so much. Um, okay, yum. Ooh. What? Yeah, this is just gorgeous. All types of aesthetics. Which one was that? I don't want to. You got a chip full of that? Wait, which one? Hello. Put it in the middle. Like some frozen samples today. We do have a mixed cocktail too. So you can like, Okay, what's the mix? <laughs> the mix is a gypsy black extra aged with ginger beer. That actually is very light. It goes down pretty easy. Okay. okay. I want something like this. <laughs> 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 okay, but let me see. This, this is, is the one. This one is so aesthetically pleasing. Yeah. It's nice. It's nice. And the other one is a gypsy double bourbon served meat. So that one's going to be like a hot drink bowl because they put it in two different barrels at meat. Yeah. I'm gonna want the cocktail for sure. Thank you so much. Yeah. Even it smells good. Thank you so much. It smells. Girl, I am not a shop girl. Did you want to take it? No. Oh. Taste that one. Oh no, she you was, said I, you no, need to taste. I heard her. I tasted it too. Oh, that's the one. You said you need to get all the reactions. You got a chip to tame it. Okay, first of all, I just want the flavor of that. It's got so much. Look at my because it made me cough when I did this in it. I don't have the time to eat. I don't know about. I think my favorite is mango, but that's the sweetest. It's sweet. I think that's why I like it. Yeah. Okay, can we. Uh, oh, that is hot. Hey, you get copyrighted. Hey! <laughs> no, 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 that's not how shots work. I never had her. Me either. So, cheers to drinking bourbon for the first time. Me moving to Portland. Happy holidays and your Christmas party. Yay! And your a safe and tools. quick recovery. Oh, that was amazing.
Yeah, but why is it fizzy? It went down with ginger, ginger beer. beer. Oh. It wasn't pure bourbon, isn't it? Okay. That was weird. like to go down. That was yeah, well, but I never drank bourbon. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I was the right person to bring on this margarita tasting. I don't know if my palate's sophisticated enough. I don't know if my palate's sophisticated enough to make a proper judgment. So all of these are nasty to me except for this mango one. <sighs> Feels so good. I'm looking crazy as hell. I literally just woke up. I think it's like 7.30 in the morning or something, but I just realized that I didn't even end the freaking vlog last night. I was so exhausted yesterday because as you guys know, <sighs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I was so exhausted. So I, I, I can't talk when I first wake up. I was so exhausted last night. Um, Obviously coming from Florida, I'm like, my body's used to being three hours ahead. So even though it was only 10, it felt like it was so late and I was so exhausted. So when I came home, I just knocked out. Like, I don't even think I washed my face. Matter of fact, I didn't wash my face, which is so nasty because I was traveling all day. So, ew. Um, but yeah, so I got a good night's sleep. The vlog was really, like, uneventful because all I was doing was traveling and, you know, doing random little things so it wasn't that eventful but i really want to start vlogging for you guys more so if you enjoyed the vlog definitely be sure to give it a giant thumbs up and of course comment down below if you aren't already be sure to subscribe and join the fam because there's going to be so much content coming soon i'm so excited for what the future has in store so um but yeah this was just a quick little day of me moving to portland i thought it would be cool to kind of capture the moment and have it to look back on and always remember like oh this is the day that i moved to portland so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye